Du, 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 du. Oh, what the? Has this ever happened to you? Chances are if you live in the top end, it has. Hello, my name's Sandra Kendall and I like to make picture books and art about Australian native animals. Now, one of our most common native animal visitors to our backyards in the top end is the green tree frogs. You know, they're the ones that go... They love to hang out near people because we have created really nice habitat for them in our gardens. Green tree frogs are nocturnal. They love our electric lights at night time because they attract lots of tasty frog food. They have sticky pads on their toes so they can climb almost anything. Green tree frogs are also carnivores. They eat mainly insects like moths and cockroaches, but they also eat spiders and even geckos and small mammals. Frogs use their sticky tongues to catch their food. Unlike humans, their tongue is not attached to the back of their mouth, so it's attached to the front and it's easier for them to stick their tongue out much further. Green tree frogs are at their most active in the wet season. This is when they mate. They're amphibians, so they lay their eggs in water. You may even have found their eggs in your pond or pool. The eggs hatch into tadpoles, which have tails, and they breathe through gills. The tadpoles live in water until they grow legs and lungs, and they change into adult frogs. This process takes about five weeks. Although the adult frogs live on land, they also need to be near water, swamps, ponds or other damp places like drain pipes. Drain pipes can also act as a handy megaphone, especially for the male frogs when they're trying to attract a female. It just makes their call really loud. Now they need to be near water because they'll die if their skin dries out too much because instead of drinking water, frogs soak it through into their body through their skin. That's why, especially at the start of the dry season, we sometimes find green tree frogs hiding in our toilet or shower. So if you do find one of these little guys hiding in your toilet or shower, just make sure to wash your hands before you pick them up and make sure you don't have any soap on there and just pick them up really gently and put them out into the garden. And remember, green tree frogs are fabulous.